Hi, we're at Eclectic Gallery, and we have our third annual Modern Visionary Show up. And it's such an exciting show because it features all local artists, um, predominantly the Lemners, and uh, we have such an amazing collection this year. Uh, we never know where they're going to come from and how many we'll get, but we have actually over 40 Siebners. We have several uh, Pat Martin Bates, we have Fleming Jorgensen, uh, just a, the, a huge range of different artists. And the, the artworks are um, really a, an amazing caliber. You know, we've had, you know, Siebners come and go and, and we've all seen some that are so-so and some that are fabulous. And we have many that are fabulous and we have some very wonderful pieces. Um, we have one Chichamara that, that arrived and it's, um, it's unlike any of the other Chichamaras that I've ever seen and it's, it's fishing flies and he it looks like he used a brush that had maybe three hairs in it. They're so finely done and he used to call them his finger exercises where he would warm up by painting each little hair on the, on the fishing lure. He was an avid fisherman, like fly fishing. But um, it's wonderful to see such a range of work. And also we have a, a great collection of, of pottery that comes directly from the estate of Walter Dexter. So Walter has shown with us for a number of years and we were just very delighted to, to be offered um, his pottery. So we were given, I think, 150 pieces of pottery in, and also artwork from his collection. So in here we have uh, pieces by Leslie Poole, um, Phyllis Sirota and a number of other artists that he collected. He, he really had a great eye and, and he collected some of the best examples of each artist's work. And these were pieces that he lived with, pieces that were in his home uh, right up until the end. And so the work that is on the walls all comes from private collections. It's, um, this is our third show and, and we've made you know, great introductions to to some of the wonderful collections in Victoria. And in some cases, people are downsizing. In other cases, they just have art in the closets and art you know, overflowing. But it's this particular period of work that interests us. And it's, it's really the 70s, 80s, 90s, you know, up till you know, 2000, a, a body of work that represents really the best of Victoria's artists. And many of these artists have huge international reputations. Um, Walter received the uh, Sadie Bronfman Award uh, for his ceramic work, and uh, which is now the Governor General's Medal. You know, Michael Morris, uh, although he doesn't have works in this show, uh, he's also received the Governor General's Medal. And the artwork is a great lesson in, in art history of local artists. You know, I think many of your audience will know about the Limners and about the movement that they really created. It, it, it's, it's fascinating. There were 19 artists as members of the Limners and they were a very dynamic group. Uh, they really enjoyed having parties together. They celebrated each other's work and they, they co-sponsored exhibits. Um, even in furniture stores, standard furniture had a show of Limner's work. I mean, how great would that be? <laughs> so they weren't afraid of showing in off-the-wall places and, and out-of-the-way places. So they really created venues for their own work and they supported each other. Many of them are pieces that were uh, autographed or signed to another Limner member. Um, we have uh, many original pieces from Robin, Skelt Robin and Sil Sylvia Skelton, who were both limners. So we have a number of works from their collection as well. And the, the show has just grown and grown, and uh, we're, we're thrilled with it. It's had wonderful public response, and it seems that the media has caught on as well, and it's just you know, helping to celebrate these artists and this body of work in particular. Uh, we're keeping the show up through June, and um, it's, uh, it's going to feature some new artists that we'll introduce uh, for, the, for the June part of the show. Uh, there's, I think, three pieces by P.K. Page, and you very seldom see her work. She was primarily known as, as a, a poet, but to see some of the graphic works that she did uh, will be quite interesting for, for people. So the, the show um, 
has uh, you know quite a range in prices. Um, we try to be very modest in our pricing so that they're affordable to you know to anyone. But there's also some you know excellent pieces within the show. Um, and recently, we've uh, received several of Jan and Helga Grove's pottery pieces, which are very, uh, very stylized, very streamlined, and, and beautiful design. So I encourage everybody to come and see the show.